Hey, Advanced Band members, it's Mr. Wood. Hopefully you remember me. We are so excited to get started again. Um, this year, there's going to be a few changes. First off, if you haven't had a chance to look at your schedule, make sure you do that. And you're going to notice that Symphonic Band is going to be third period. And then Honor Band is going to be fourth period. Speaking of um, Honor Band, let me introduce us to our new band director. Her name is Mrs. Webb. Hi, I'm Mrs. Webb, and I'm so excited to meet you guys. I'm a clarinet player, and I've been teaching for 17 years. I have two daughters, Eva and Olivia, who are seven and five. Um, I'll be teaching honor band, which is fourth period. And then um, getting back to camp this week. So again, we understand if you're out of town, but we really hope you can make it. When you guys come on Thursday, and that's this Thursday that we're having camp, it's going to be from 4 to 6.30, and it's just for honor and symphonic band members. When you get here, just go through the main entrance that goes to the cafeteria, not the band hall door. Go to the main entrance, report to the cafeteria, and you, we're going to have the woodwinds more in the front. Brass will be kind of in the middle section. Percussion will be at the end. I am going to have some signs, so just look for your, your place about where to go. Okay, um, and then um, really just hold up. I know we're going to be so excited to play together. Just kind of find your spot, sit down, talk to your friends, because we're going to do a couple activities before we break out our instruments. So wait for us to tell you when to unpack. You're going to need your instrument, a one inch black binder with pockets, a flip folder, and a pencil. As far as the days go, in case you haven't had a chance to check out the website, and it's on the homepage of the website where it goes into all the details, but we do have theme days. On Thursday, it's going to be neon, so everything you got. So like whether it's headbands or hats or glasses or whatever, so just really kind of do it up. I'm going to do my best neon stuff too. Friday is going to be camo. Maybe if you don't have camo, think about just like darker colors, whether it's greens or olives, browns, blacks, all that fun stuff. And then Monday, it's going to be sports themes. And so think about like maybe your, your favorite jersey that you have. Maybe it's a team that you currently play on and you want to just wear your, your baseball jersey or your soccer jersey. Um, we're also in the middle of the, the Olympics if you want to like support USA, any of that kind of stuff. But Monday is a special day because we're going to have a shorter playing time and then we're going to break for pizza, we're going to eat, and then we're going to just do some games. And there will be just some fun things, some ways to get to know us. And then Tuesday is Colt Camp, and so we're going to be wearing our blue band t-shirts. If you didn't get one last year, we'll make sure we take care of that those first couple days of camp. And shorts, because when we play, it won't be for very long, but we are going to be outside. And so it may be hot, and so make sure that you guys are um, wearing shorts. You may want to wear some sunglasses or maybe even a hat. Also, be sure to bring water. And then um, we'll just kind of jump in. Now, I know some of us aren't sure what to do with these themes. And I know one of the worst things, and this might be stuff of nightmares, of you walking in full neon and you're the only one doing it. Guys, we're all going to hopefully wear neon. We're going to have prizes for the most section participation and the number one student who went all out. And so it's going to be a great prize. And so if you want that, definitely do as much as you can as far as neon goes, whether it's like even like coloring your hair, all sorts of crazy stuff. So we hope to see you there. Uh, Miss Webb is going to talk to us about the first day of school now. I know last year we told you that you would be playing the first day, but you will not need instruments until Monday, August 16th. Um, I know there are different drop-off places around the school, but everybody in band will be dropped off over by the band room, and you may enter through the band hall. Um, if you have schedule concerns, please reach out now to us or the counselors, and the schedules are in hack. And finally, I know some of us have maybe taken a little bit of a break um, and you're playing. We get that. That happens. But now is a great time to obviously get your instrument out, play a few notes, blow those cobwebs out. If there's anything going on wrong with that, we need to try to get that fixed ASAP. Um, obviously, we can look at your instrument during camp if we need to. But make sure, especially if you're not coming to camp, that, that you break that out and start kind of getting into the rhythm of playing again. Um, we're really excited to see you guys, and we hope that everyone can make it. And we will see you on Thursday.